There's nothing like chilling with my girls. Just me and my divas taking over the world. Buzz, what's up, Debos? What's up? Y'all already know what time it is. It's the my first wig wig. You know, I always say, say the best for last, save the best for last. You heard, girl, let me just say this I'm trying to save my edges for the best of everything, okay? Girl, let me tell y'all, and I did say this in the video prior to that, but I just want to go up first. Girl, listen, let me tell y'all, I seen this video pop up on YouTube talking about fenugreek oil, make your hair grow, all this. So, you know, I went on Amazon, found this bottle, girl, for the last two days. I'm like, why is my head sore? Like, I've been brushing, over brushing my scalp, like my thoughts, okay? You know, I've been trying to work this little short hairstyle that I got. I'm trying to find something that'll, you know, match me, match my energy, just match my head shape, girl, okay? I was using like, you know, a good brush, a big sturdy hard brush, and I was using my products. Girl, I was brushing so hard one time, I thought that my skin had came out on the brush. I thought that I was irritating myself. Come to find out this is this stuff, burning the crap out of my damn scalp right here. Girl, I have already started my Amazon return because this is going back, $17 refunded back to my account. I did start reading other reviews today after it and I did see a few people say how their scalp was itching, how it was burning, turned them red. Honey, do you see that? Do y'all see that, okay? Like, this is really irritating. So I did put some Neosporin cream on it. Oh my God, I am in so much, like, it just is inflamed, inflamed. And I'm like trying to grow my hair and God damn. It's like, and it's only in the part where it's sensitive. I did put some in this area, but for some reason it did not bother me on this portion. But all, well, it is a tad bit red right here, but it doesn't hurt. But right here, in here, oh my God, it's so sore, it's sore, it's sore. And I really thought, oh my God, stop brushing your scalp so hard, April. You just gotta live with the little short hairstyle. I mean, I do want my hair to grow back, but I do want my skin to be attached to it when it grow back, you know what I'm saying? So Amazon, you can have your stuff back. Um, If y'all know how to soothe this or whatever, please leave a comment below what you would put on this because I've been just putting Neosporin cream, not the Vaseline like Neosporin, not the ointment like Neosporin, but they have a white cream. It's cooling, it's to the paint. Girl, whew. I'm trying to find my aloe vera gel um, and I will find that before the night is over. I've been just having a day, okay? Like seriously, a day. I tried to do like what I wore with this wig, but girl, what I wore won't fit anymore. So I'm gonna just be right here and we're not gonna put on no outfits today because girl, I'm not about to be playing around with the clothes closet or anything like that. If you really wanna see me rocking out there, what wig I'm gonna wear is gonna be a Hanes sweatshirt and sweatpants from Wally Worlds, straight up. The elastic is doing me justice these days. But anyway, like I said, you know what I'm saying? It's time for my first wig with, yeah, it's their edges, the, the, the natural kinky curly edges lace front. Girl, I got her prepared. Last video I did, I had to prepare her on camera, but I was not trying to play around. So look, she is already ready to go. What do you know? Didn't even have to wash her straight out the box. She is a fox ready to throw on, slay, do it like it's your bidet, baby. This is what you about to do. So meanwhile, while I take these little pink curls out, I'm gonna show you how your wig comes from my first wig, girl. Then we gonna jump right into it. Hey baby, do you believe me? When I say I miss you so, it seems like your mind is elsewhere. Never on your own Something you're not telling me yet I believe it's true You're all for someone new I've never felt this stupid Thinking I'm enough for you Tell me is she cute? Is she my substitute? I've never felt so certain That I've had enough for you Hey cheetah, do you feel bad? Someone 
So let's get into this. I'm going to adhere it lightly, y'all, okay? Because for one, my edges are on fire. Like, you know what I'm saying? They are definitely inflamed and hurting. So I'm not really going to be sticking it down like that, like that, but just enough, okay? So first of all, you want to make sure that your hairspray is tacky prior to adhering any lace wig your glue your hairspray honey whatever you use to make sure that it's tacky you can put one to two to three layers on it's up to you now i did put two layers on on this unit but i let it get tacky y'all know i always use my aussie instant freeze honey and then i'm gonna just take my rat tail cone and i'm gonna separate these natural kinky curly edges okay right after i put a little bit more spray now what i mean separate is i mean i this is my preference i don't want my edges so thick like this so what i'm gonna do is i'm just gonna part in between them okay first i'm gonna put a little bit more hairspray okay but i'm gonna part in between the natural curly edges and whatever amount that i don't use whatever hairs that i don't use i'm gonna just brush it up into the actual unit i don't want to pluck them off i don't want to remove the hairs i just want to brush them up see that's the good thing about these natural curly edges you can definitely separate them and brush them into the unit if you don't want to use them all girl okay so as y'all see right here i'm just separating them with my wrap tail cone and then brushing them upwards combing them upwards like so now in a second you're gonna see me use my um my new favorite mark anthony styling foam now i get this stuff from amazon you can get it i'm not really sure where you can get it from but it's ten dollars it says for curly hair curl enhancers girl that stuff is good for anything i don't know why they lie but you can use that for anything it works really well with basically almost all my units i've never had an issue plus it seems like it doesn't interfere with the hairspray that i'm using so this is it right here strictly curls but honey it's not today and for ten dollars i'm using this for whatever i want okay and as you see i'm just just taking it and just taking it and brushing it into the hairs that i decided not to use now the one thing that i really do like a lot about this foam is it doesn't get liquid it doesn't get watery runny within a few seconds girl it will stay foam for a minute so that's the one thing that i respect about the mark anthony's curl enhancer foam styling foam it's mousse it's just mousse but all i do is just take it and take the hairs and brush them into the unit this is easy way easier than plucking them plus with the natural curly edges you really don't have to customize the hairline too much that being said not with all wigs so i'm saying with my first wigs you ain't really got to customize much and nothing so that's what i'm saying now i can't speak for every lace wig company but with my first wigs you don't have to customize it too much now my elastic band I'm gonna throw that right on girl so that way it'll dry it'll settle in and so forth now as y'all see this hair is really nice and thick it was easy to curl baby it was super easy to curl and i did i think i had the pin curls in for like five days if i'm not mistaken super easy nothing too hard and you know now i'm gonna just fix it up for you boo and we're gonna let it do what it do
right, you guys, this is it. Let me tell y'all, this was so easy. I love the kinky hair edges. The natural curly edges are what's it. Like, seriously, you don't have to pluck it. I mean, like, let me stop lying because you might have to pluck some of them. But all I do is brush the extra hair up into my unit, just like you see, so that way I don't have to pluck it. I don't have to disturb it. I don't have to worry about it. I just brush it right on up. And I don't even brush it even, honey. You know, I might be smaller, but a little bit here, a little bit more here, because it's supposed to be edges. They're supposed to be even. But girl, yes, this wig is everything. I did cut them because they were a little bit long. I didn't want them so long. Now, as far as the texture, beautiful kinky straight texture. I like it. I love kinky straight hair. I did put some curls in it. I think I curled this probably like five days prior to this video. So I did keep the pin curls, the pins in them, but it did drop a little bit. Some of them I didn't want it so fluffy. So I did take my uh, flat iron and kind of like, you know, flatten them out, straighten them out a little bit because it was just, I didn't want it so bouncy, you know what I mean? But it curls so nicely. This one was really easy to curl and flat iron. I do say, I will say that. Look, girl, if you want you a nice, kinky, straight wig, girl, do it like it's your day. Look at these edges. Let's slay. Hello, girl. Look at that. Okay, honey. Natural lace, girl. My first wig, do it all the time. My first wig, do it like it's your day, baby. Do it like you're growing a sex day with my first wig. I'm saying this wig is really cute, okay? Y'all know I love this texture here. Y'all know I love my first wig and their sister company, RPG Show. You can never go wrong with none of their wigs. Some people might say they're a little pricey, but girl, you get what you pay for and you ain't got to do nothing but throw this baby on out the box. I'm loving the new curly natural edges. Now, listen, if you are not a huge fan of so much, just brush them up into the unit. You don't have to pre-pluck them. You don't have to tuck them. Just brush them right on up, girl. Use you some good foam. And I'm telling you, I promise you, they'll be okay. I didn't want to pluck them because, listen, one minute I might like them thicker, one minute I don't. And I didn't want to destroy the wig because, girl, listen, these are some getting used to. But it does make the hairline look a whole lot more natural. And I promise, this makes the wig application a lot easier. To me, that is. I'd rather do this versus the baby hairs and all of that. Like, this is much easier because it's natural. You really don't have to lay it down. You can just leave it all out like this. And then you're good to go. Like, this is, this is, look at this girl look, okay? Look at that. Please. What? Like, this is so much easier versus doing all that baby hair work. Girl, honey, listen, let me tell y'all. When I have to do baby hairs, I'll be just like, oh, my God, here we go. Please get it right. Sometimes I'll be brushing so hard in one spot that my hair turned red. Y'all don't know that because I have to edit that part out. I don't really want to sit y'all down for that long, like 20 minutes while I do some daggone baby hairs. So these natural curly edges, girl, they will save you time. You can just walk out like this. Nobody will even know. You'll be good to go. I'm telling you, with my first wigs, you will definitely slay, and you will do it like it's your B-day every day. Okay? So. So on that note, I will see y'all in the comments. Make sure you rate, comment, subscribe, thumbs this video up. What y'all think about these new curly natural edges? Let me know, okay? I love y'all. Make sure you rate, comment, subscribe, thumbs it up if I didn't say that already. But I will see y'all in the next one. Go, go, go.